this is the Baby Cargo! Hi everyone, it's Holly Schultz from BabyGizmo.com. This is a stroller from a brand new baby gear company called Baby Cargo. It's a brand new company, like I said, that has strollers. They're going to have stroller accessories, high chairs, and even play spaces. But right now I'm going to show you one of their strollers. This is their top of the line stroller, the umbrella stroller. It's called the 300 series. And at first glance, what I love is I love the fabric. It's a really soft, really durable, cool looking fabric. Comes in three different colors. This one's called black top, but at first glance it kind of looks a little bluish, a little black, but whatever it is, it's really cool. Um, so let's show you the ins and outs of the Baby Cargo 300 series. Now this umbrella stroller has a very high weight capacity of 50 pounds. It has a roomy seat. It's 13 inches wide with a 19 inch seat back, which seems a little short, but from the back of the seat to the top of the canopy is 28 inches, so your taller children are totally going to fit in this seat. It has a 10 inch leg drop, and what I call that is from where the seat breaks to where they place their feet. It has an adjustable leg rest, so you can put it up for the smaller children and down for your long-legged kids. Now it has a padded adjustable five-point harness, and the harness buckle, huh, kind of easy to do, I have to tell you, it's one touch button, push it and your kids out in a jiffy. So you're just gonna have to teach them how to stay in this stroller. It has a recline, and it's a very easy do, to do recline. It's one-handed, not a strap system, but you squeeze this piece and you put it back and that's as far as it goes. So I would say it's not quite flat, so I wouldn't put a newborn in it, I would say about six months old. Now the back of the canopy, you can raise it up so that you can allow air to circulate through the stroller on a hot day, or if it's cold, you just wanna attach it like that. While we're back here, let me show you, there is a parent pocket. It's a zipper pocket back here. It can hold your cell phone, keys, whatever you want to throw in there, which is great. Now putting the seat up, all you have to do is lift it up, and that's going to put it in one of the three positions. As you can see, this is as upright as the seat gets, so if that's a concern to you, it's not completely 90 degrees, but it's not fully reclined either. So from there all the way to there, so I would say from six months up for the stroller. Now while I'm down here, let me talk about the basket. The basket, let me tell you, it's not huge. It's a small basket. You're going to get a very small diaper bag, maybe one of those, you know, diapies and wipies, or some baby essentials in there. And if your seat is fully reclined, you're not going to be able to access the basket very easily, except from the sides for small items. Now, the stroller, it rolls on five and a half inch hard rubber wheels. Um, there, It's an umbrella stroller, so it's going to be best on smooth surfaces, at the mall. Um, definitely not an all-terrain stroller, but again, it's an umbrella stroller. The front wheels do lock straight, so if you do want to take it on a bit, you know, all-terrain, some of that playground mulch or something like that, just lock those front wheels and it's going to handle it much better. The 300 series has all-wheel suspension, so it's going to help absorb some of those bumps. There are brakes in the back that you have to put down on individual, each individual rear wheel. All you got to do is step down lightly and that's going to engage the brake and barely tap it and that's going to let it go free. Now let's talk about the canopy. The canopy, it's a decent sized canopy. I wouldn't say it's the biggest on the market, but it's definitely going to shade your child. If you want full coverage, you're probably going to have to add a canopy extension. Now, instead of your standard peekaboo window, this one has a full viewing window. And what's great is I don't have to be opening to peek. I can just see right in. And it is shaded, so on the inside, if the sun's shining, it's still not going to have the sun directly on your baby. So just the way they shaded it with the mesh on the inside, I can see in, but it's not going to be terribly bright in the seat. One more thing I wanted to mention about the viewing window is because it goes all the way down to here, your older children are still going to be able to see out, so they're not going to feel so enclosed in the seat. Now, the handlebars, the handlebars, these are high handles. If you're at all and you're looking for an umbrella stroller, this might be it. They are 42 inches from where I place my hands to the ground, so again, very good for a tall parent. Now, just like all umbrella strollers, there's no baby tray or baby cup holder. But what I like is that there is a parent cup holder, you could use it for a bottle if you wanted to, on the back here. And it's not one of those that falls off every time, you know, you fold the stroller or you're moving. It's actually a very secure cup holder, which I like. 
and the maneuverability on the 300 series, it's very good. Um, the stroller is very easy to push, like I said, on smooth surfaces. If I have a 50 pound child in there, I'm going to have to use two hands. But if I have a smaller baby, I can't move this one around with one hand um, as long as I'm on smooth surfaces. Now what I like is that the 300 series comes with a rain guard and it comes with a little pouch to store it in if you want to store it in the basket. Now it goes over the front. It's not going to cover the top of the stroller, but it goes over the front. It attaches on the buttons over here and then it keeps the rain off of your child. Now folding the stroller is very easy to do. Just put back your canopy and you can leave your cup holder attached. Now you can do it two ways. You can lift this button with your foot or you can pull up on the carry strap. That's going to unlock, unlock the frame. Step down on the side. And there you go. It folds down into an umbrella fold, has an automatic lock, which I love, and it only weighs 15 pounds and has this carry strap. So I can fling it over my shoulder and carry it through an airport or while I'm traveling. And if I want it to lean against the wall, I just lock both wheels and I can lean it against the wall without it rolling away on me. Now, unfolding it couldn't be easier. Just set it down, unlock your automatic lock, pull up. Step down on the rear pedal until it locks open and you are pretty much ready to go. You can also unfold the stroller while holding it upright. All you got to do is lean down, unlock that, let it fall, fall down, step down, and it's easy as that. Overall, I really like the Baby Cargo 300 series. One of my favorite features is this fabric. I'm telling you, it's soft, it's durable, it's just... One of those details that Baby Cargo really paid attention to, to what parents want. Like the cup holder art that's included. I love an included cup holder. It also has these cool grippers on the handles that if I'm, you know, strolling with one hand, it's just going to give me a little bit better grip. So it's those details that they paid attention to that make it stand apart from the other umbrella strollers on the market. It also has that big seat with the 50 pound weight capacity. It has the great peekaboo window, not the biggest canopy, but everything else you know, it's easy to maneuver. I like that it comes with the rain guard and it retails for $179. So it's not going to break the bank for a luxury umbrella stroller. Um, so there you go. That's my look at the Baby Cargo 300 series. And I'm Holly Schultz from babygizmo.com.